Hey what's going on guys and welcome back to Media Viral. My name is Jamie and in today's video we'll be counting down the 10 things inspired by dreams. Before we start if you're new around here then make sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon to never miss a notification and like the video for more weekly list videos. With all that out of the way let's get straight into the video with the number 10 spot which is going to be the film Inception. I've always found dreams to be a very interesting part of my life. Everything within that dream is created by your own mind as you experience it. Christopher Nolan, as he describes his love for dreams, this very idea of a dream birthed the entire film that is Inception. In at number 9 is Edgar Allan Poe's poetry. It's reported that Edgar Allan Poe suffered his whole life with terrible nightmares, some of which inspired him to write certain pieces of his poetry. Pieces like Dreamland and A Dream Within a Dream are two very commonly known ones. In at number 8 is going to be the song Yesterday by the Beatles. The melody of the song Yesterday was conjured up by Paul McCartney when he was dreaming. He says that he dreamt this melody and when he woke up, up, he immediately went to the piano and found the chords in order to recreate the sound that was in his head. McCartney was sure at the time that he had heard it in another song somewhere else, but when showing his friends, none of them could ever recall ever hearing this melody previous to this. In at number 7 is The Sewing Machine. In 1845, Elias Howe had a frightening nightmare in which he was given an ultimatum by a group of cannibals who had captured him. Invent a sewing machine in 24 hours or suffer a painful death. Hal failed and thus was killed by the group of cannibals by being stabbed to death by their spears which had holes in the tips. It was at this point where Hal realised that he had to put an eye in the needle in order to create the lock stitch sewing machine that he had previously been struggling to complete. In at number 6 is Einstein's theory of relativity. Einstein had a dream one night where he was walking through a field and saw a group of cows gathered around an electric fence. The farmer turned on the electric to the fence and Einstein saw all the cows jump back at once. However, the farmer saw the cows jump back one by one in a wave formation. It was at this point where Einstein came up with the theory of relativity, as things look different depending on where you stand because of the time it takes for light to hit your eyes. In at number 5 is Salvador Dali's Persistence of Memory. Arguably, Dali's most notorious painting is The Persistence of Memory. This painting depicts various melted clocks in a desert setting. As random as this may seem, Dali got this image entirely from a dream that he later managed to keep in his memory and paint onto a canvas. In at number 4 is The Terminator. In a dream, James Cameron witnessed a huge explosion, followed by a cut-in-half cyborg crawling towards him with kitchen knives. After dreaming this, Cameron did a rough sketch of The Terminator, later being moulded into what we know today by Arnold Schwarzenegger himself. In at number 3 is the periodic table. The periodic table took over 10 years to finally get its form in which we see today. Dmitry Mendeleev would come up with various forms of the table, but it just wouldn't work the way he wanted it to. One night Mendeleev went to sleep after tirelessly working on a layout that wasn't coming to him. During his sleep he saw the modern day layout of the periodic table taking shape, describing how the elements just fell into place and he saw the layout that worked. He woke up and began sketching a new periodic table down on a piece of paper and finally after 10 years of hard work Mendeleev managed to find the layout for the elements that worked. In at number 2 is the double helix structure of DNA. James Watson one night dreamt of a spiral staircase. As simple as this may seem, Watson saw more than just a spiral staircase. He saw the structure for a double helix DNA strand. He went on to win a Nobel Prize for this discovery. In at number 1 is the chemical structure of benzene. Scientists were stumped for a while over the chemical structure of the element benzene, thinking it was actually impossible to find. Friedrich August Kekulé had a dream one night of a group of snakes eating their own tails, and right there was the point in which Kekulé realised that he was looking at the structure of benzene. Do you know of any other films, TV shows, books or other forms of media inspired by dreams? Put them down in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more weekly videos. Turn on notifications to be notified of a new video and comment any suggestions down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see all of you guys in the next video.